Hey there guys, this is Pushkadua from Gadget Geeks. Today I'm gonna show you how to fix this no connection error on Google Play Store. So you might uh, face this problem. What you wanna do is to fix this problem. I have some tips for you. You, might, you may try that and if that doesn't work, uh, then I have a bigger solution for you and for that I uh, think you need a root, root access. So <clears throat> first step what would you uh, want to do is that clear your cache on your Android device. Just open up the Play Store, minimize it, open the app info for it, app info for Play Store, clear data and clear cache. Just uh, press these two buttons and op try to open the Play Store. If it works, then it's good. If it doesn't, then I have another option. You might want to check your date and time. Just make sure your time your uh, is synchronized with internet. Just make automatic update time or select home time zone or it might be different uh, according to your Android version. It uh, basically the this thing works on all Android versions, so I would recommend you to just um, switch to internet time or automatic update time if you have not done that, and just open up the Play Store and see if it works. And if it does not, just make sure uh, then recheck that the password and the ID you are entering, the Gmail password is correct. And if it is not, then uh, you might wanna just recheck it and the fourth option is here um, <clears throat> it is a kind of a limitation for people who don't have root access sorry about that uh, if you don't have root access the, what you want to do would be uh, the last option for you would be factory reset your phone and I would show how to do that if you are running the Android version 4.4.2 or KitKat I would uh, just say open up the settings go to backup and reset and just press factory data reset and just pre press reset phone or you can figure that out easily basically you want to go to backup and reset menu and if you have root access then there is a last option or I should say second last option that you might want to try so what that option is that uh, I have given a link for this um, file manager it is a root file manager just install this uh, you can get the APK um, down there and link is in the description just uh, open that link download this file manager install it and once you uh, have installed this file manager open it open the settings make sure you have uh, checked these two uh, uh, two checkboxes named as root explorer and mount system folders if these both uh, checkboxes are checked just press up till you get to the root once you are in root directory find the folder etc that is etc etc folder and open the host file open it as text and you can open it as text editor open it with text editor it might take some time as it is because uh, very a big file you just might wanna wait for a while let it be okay once you open this file all you have to do is delete all the data in this file just select all and cut or delete you don't want all the data what you want is a simple line which says 127 127.0.0.1 space localhost If you are having any problem in uh, just writing it and just uh, just write it 
and save it save your modification put on uh, just click yes I would uh, not do that because my play store is already working okay what I was saying is if you are having any problem with this you can just copy it from the description or I have this local uh, local host file updated um, just upload it you can download that and overwrite it uh, that's it for now and just try your play store now or uh, after doing this I would recommend you to restore uh, sorry reboot once you reboot your device and open the play store it should be working I guess 99 percent it should be working and if it doesn't the last option for you is always you can do the factory reset but I don't think so you would require that all you need to do is just um, update the host file reboot and open the play store it should work and if it worked please please do um, comment and like this video please subscribe to my channel share this video and I'll be very thankful to you so till then see ya I'll make more videos soon so bye bye